Betty, they're still out there. We don't know who they are. We don't know where they went. All we know is it happened right here on Main Street here in Stoneham. And at this hour, those guys are still on the loose. How is this place is targeted in particular? Police say the two suspects knew exactly what they were doing when they went into the Stoneham coin shop just after nine this morning, armed with tasers. But first, some business. They had a quantity of jewelry that they wanted to either sell or exchange. And while that transaction was taking place, one of the suspects pulled out a taser and apparently tased one of the employees. The other employee happened to hear what he thought was a taser being activated, came out, and he himself was incapacitated. One worker, described as an older man, was taken to Leahy with a minor head injury. The other was treated at the scene. As for the two suspects, described as two Hispanic men, one with a medium build, they made off with an undisclosed amount in coins from the store. In this particular case, it would be an armed robbery where they used a weapon. And the store is closed today, but it is still a mess inside, and you might be able to still make out some of the valuables left on the floor. This is not the first time, though, colonial trading has been a crime scene earlier this year. Back in March, in fact, it was a target of a different kind of robbery. Stoneham Police gave News Center 5 these photos of a smash and grab in which thieves made off with more than a quarter million dollars in valuables. That's still an open case, and when asked if there could be a connection, it's always a possibility. And we did talk to one coin dealer who stopped by the store, didn't know what happened earlier in the day, and he told us he was concerned for the owner's safety because this is tucked off the side of the road. There's no direct sight of Main Street, so a little bit worried about police presence. Nonetheless, we will have more on this coming up. New Center 5 at 6 o'clock. For now, we are live in Stoneham. I'm Jim Loke, WCDB News Center 5.